got the anti-riding shogun training. The anti-riding shogun training. <laughs> oh god! We're gonna do it here? Uh, and what's this mechanism for? Let me guess, it's to simulate the, the battlefield we were in last time. Think of it as a catalyst that can reproduce the Raiden Shogun's combat moves. It'll give you a chance to figure out her moves in advance and come up with a counter strategy. That should be a big help, don't you think? Even if that was the case, like, she's gonna come up with the whole... Uh... Divine Punishment? And uh, vision decree thing, where she prevents you from using elementals, and she also pre and kills you right up front. The aim is to try to not get hit by the attacks, since you've escaped certain death at her hand once already. <clears throat> I presume this shouldn't be more than you can handle. Mm -hmm. Escaping death and more, not more than you can handle, are a little bit like. I don't know, like overwhelming someone and and being able to ha not handle too much are almost two completely different things. Or almost the same thing, now that I think about it. Ugh. I get hung up on these concepts. Oh god. Here we go. There we go. Ah! Uh oh. Number of times. Dang it, okay. Avoid being hit. Oh crap. Dang it. Nope! 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 Strike where are you gonna strike? Nope. I dodged that. Didn't dodge that. Oh, I didn't dodge it, but it counted as dodging. Number of times hit. Number of times hit, so I'm actually supposed to get hit. Avoid being hit by the fish. There we go. Challenge failed. Ah! being hit. Crap. So we're just getting hit. We're not dodging. So we actually have to sit there and do it. Ow. Oh wait, ah, oh, that wasn't the finishing move. Number of times hit. Okay, so I gotta avoid being hit. Dang it. Faster? Failed. How do you not get hit? One eternity later. How to avoid the finishing move? Okay. Damn it. Okay, I know what I need to do. I gotta kill that thing fast. Eventually. 
Got it. There we go. I avoided the finishing move. That's how you do it. There's no way you can dodge it from all angles. You gotta get rid of it from one. Ugh. <clears throat> what a workout. Is that it? So how come you know so much about the writing children? I bet I'm going to hear she knew about the Raiden Shogun before and they were best friends and now the best friend is now turned into that. Mm -hmm. You mean <clears throat> me? Yes. Perhaps it's because I'm the Electro Archon's familiar. Familiar? What? Like Devalin is to Barbados? Huh. Never would have guessed by looking at you. <laughs> It sounds like you'd be more persuaded if you saw me in my fox form. So not only are you uh, familiar to uh, the Ryan Shogun, but you're also a kitsune. <clears throat> I'd like to see that. In your dreams. Oh, okay. Aww. I'm gonna... <laughs> Yaimiko has, like, a lot of... Um, uh, I'll make a claim, but you'll have to believe me to see it. You'll, you'll do, um, he, oh, screw it, I can't even think. You'll somehow rescue me from that and make the other person beg in mercy. But you'll, but you won't show how it is, but you also do the same thing here. More curious than my appearance is the fact that she and I don't see each other anymore, wouldn't you say? Uh, is it because of the Fatui, or is it because you couldn't see her yourself? A nation to last for all eternity is a dream that she and I both share. <clears throat> but I don't think that's the same thing as complete stasis. Hmm. At some point, she started going down a path that became increasingly difficult for me to join her on. Yeah, because, uh, that's the idea of perfection and stagnation. You don't allow things to change, and now there's, like... Incompatibility. You know, A never said goodbye to me before she stepped into the plane of Euthymia. Perhaps it's just my wishful thinking, but I think she did this deliberately as her way of keeping our friendship eternal. Mm. By neither saying goodbye nor seeing me again, our relationship will remain forever how it was. She is taking a very one side of view. Since we've embarked on two very different paths to eternity, I can either continue to maintain the status quo, or do whatever it takes to bring her back on track, regardless of the cost. Back on track. I have chosen the latter because... If stubbornly isolating herself in the plane of Euthymia is her what? idea of eternity... you mean, no... Her idea of eternity, because eternally to herself... Then my duty as her eternal familiar is to drag her back out of her own head and into the real world. So that's how we're going to solve this problem. Aw, Miko, you sound like a really great friend. What else do you expect in a friend? <laughs> <laughs> I'm only telling you this so you can properly understand my plan. Could you possibly spare the sentimentality for the time being? Can you not focus on me being friends and actually learn to save the entire nation and possibly the entire world? Anyway, that's <clears throat> enough chit-chat. Time for anti Raiden Shogun training phase two. Okay. There's a part two? Yes. There is. Oh, good. Here we go. Uh, it's our challenge. Crap. Get. Don't have a lot of health. Need. Heal. Now, eat the frickin' pizza and... Ow. It's smack so damn hard. Ow. Oh, 
There we go. Oddly enough, the first one was hard. <laughs> I don't know, maybe I didn't realize I had to, like, get rid of those things at the end. Finally done. You did quite admirably. I could see your determination and your hard work. Okay. So, do you think we're ready to beat the Raiden Shogun now? No. No, we are not. I'm gonna need a lot of help from Patrick to be able to do this one. By grinding artifacts, weapons, and all sorts of things. How do I put this? You are no match for her at all. That's basically what I just said. Wait, what? So all of this was a complete waste of time? All of it is to help you realize you can't do it. Because sometimes training is not about helping you realize you can. Sometimes training is helping you realize you cannot. Which implies a greater realization of saving yourself all the trouble and effort from wasting your time. <laughs> you are the most important part of the plan. I know what I'm doing. You don't think I'd leave you with no chance to win at all, do you? Uh, I never said that. I'm saying I'm no match for her, but that doesn't mean I don't have a chance. It just means I need to grind. Speaking <clears throat> of... Traveler, what do you think of the Resistance Army's chances? Why are we still... I feel... Like, I thought the whole plan was to get inside her head and do something about her there, but we're still talking about the Resistance. They're no match for Og uh, either. <laughs> You're absolutely <clears throat> right. Perhaps they occasionally best the Shogun's army in open battle, but when they face the Raiden Shogun herself, considering <clears throat> even their visions have been taken from them and embedded in the statue, they're ultimately quite <clears throat> helpless. Yes. You don't have to be so blunt. The Traveler's the captain of Swordfish, too, you know. Titles aren't gonna do it. <laughs> <clears throat> I don't mean to belittle them. Um, it is precisely because of their helplessness, because their visions have been taken from them, that their will is all the more <clears throat> precious. Hmm, if not ambition. In short, if everything goes according <clears throat> to plan, they may yet prove to be helpful. So what is the plan, cliché? Oh, goodness. Is that the time? I have another guest to receive. All of okay. the setting, you're entertaining guests? Uh, I'm mm. really struggling to understand how you work. You need to think harder. Hmm. Mm. Now what? Okay, we can talk here. You asked me about the plan. Before one makes a plan, what is the most important thing one must do? Think! Huh, don't know. Uh, what is it? Uh, anticipate the whole fact that even the best laid plans can go wrong. So it's best to cover our... Cover our behinds and then think to ourselves, Gee, what could possibly go wrong? You must understand <clears throat> the situation you are facing. The Ryan Shogun will stop your heart. The Vision Hunt Decree was obviously devised as a means of manipulating the Shogun. The ones behind it knowing full well her susceptibility as a puppet, with a single-minded focus on eternity. Hmm. Yes. <clears throat> this is the strongest piece of evidence we have to go on. So in other words, we need to do something about, about the Fatui first before we do something about the Ryan Shogun. Now... We also know that every aspect of the Vision Hunt Decree's promulgation and execution has been enthusiastically spearheaded by the Tenryo Commission from the outset. Yes. Ayaka was saying that every time they submitted the a petition against the, the Vision Hunt Decree, the Tenryo and Kanjo... Yes. It's all too clear that both the Tenryo and Kanjo Commissions are in some form of collusion with the Fatui. <sighs> Foolish humans, blinded by their greed. Hmm... I'd say more in pride, but greed is a whole other thing. Thus, the current situation is that our Fatui antagonist is still at large, <coughs> as the two rogue commissions wrapped around their finger, and is distributing delusions from the shadows. So I gotta do something with the Tenure Commission, the Fatui, and the Conjure Commission. Unfortunately, Given that said antagonist is under the protection of two commissions and the Raiden Shogun, 
We would be rather hard pressed to track them down. So, what should we do? It will be easier for us to start with someone from Inazuma. Mm. So, my plan is to incite rebellion in the Tenryo Commission. Okay. <laughs> That's gonna be really hard. Rebellion? <clears throat> what are you talking about? After everything you just said, it sounds like the Tenryo Commission has rebelled already. <laughs> Something like that. Yeah, we just need to push them a little further. <laughs> when I say rebellion, I don't mean betraying the Shogunate. I mean, inciting a certain someone to betray the Tenryo Commission. Is it Kamisato Ayata? If we manage to convince her, I'm quite sure we'll be able to get you another audience with the Raiden Shogun. I'll give you a clue. She's currently in charge of the Shogun's army, she visits the shrine at this time every month, and she is our guest today. Oh, I I have some idea, but I forgot the name. It's that woman who came to say torture's not okay. She also appears to be standing right behind you. Ah, uh, <laughs> don't move a muscle. You've got some nerve showing up here in the shrine when there's an active warrant for your arrest. I gotta somehow convince her to turn against the shogun. Don't even think about trying anything. Surrender now. Affirmative. Ah, uh, uh, uh. It seems that you're forgetting. This is the Grand Narukami Shrine. Mm. Use of force <sighs> here is strictly forbidden. Before you proceed, which of you would like to face criminal charges for dishonoring the shrine? Ugh. Gujiai. Please tell me you are not sheltering a wanted criminal here. We are just friends. I don't see what sheltering has to do with it. Tell your subordinates to leave. We have things to discuss. All of you outside. As you wish. They're already outside. <laughs> There's no inside to this outside. <laughs> Everyone, leave this area at once before I get confused with the word outside. Gujiai, I'm a little curious. Does it not also dishonor the Shogun to hide a wanted criminal at her grand shrine? What is your reason for not wanting to dishonor? <laughs> You're the same as ever, Kujosara. <clears throat> no one can match you when it comes to loyalty to the Shogun. Hmm. As a servant, <clears throat> loyalty to the Shogun is my duty. And as a warrior, I dedicate my life to following the way of the Shogun. Really? Even though she will one day... ...seize your vision, too? The Vision Hunt Decree is the Shogun's chosen course. And I shall not question it. Even if you're gonna become the next target. Oh, <clears throat> it's tragic. Such wholehearted devotion rendered meaningless by circumstance. Have you been kept in the dark? Or are you the only one left in the light? Lady Guji, I need you to be direct. Tell me exactly what you mean. Well, you'd have to find that out for yourself. The Vision Hunt Decree is a trap. Part of a Fatui plot to bring Inazuma to its knees. And your masters, the Kujo clan of the Tenryo Commission, they're the ones keeping the truth from reaching the Shogun. You're saying the Kujo clan betrayed the Shogunate? Yes, that's exactly what I'm saying. Guji Yai, your allegation is not only dangerous, but ridiculous. The Trine Commission <sighs> has served the Shogun since ancient times and remains absolutely loyal to this day. Mm, I do have to agree with Kujo Sara at this point because Yai Miko does have an awful habit of making claims without proof. She's gonna have to prove herself this one time. Ever since I was adopted by the Kujo clan, I have seen and heard nothing but pure devotion toward the Shogun. At every level of the Tenryo Commission, <clears throat> especially from the head of the clan, Kujo Takayuki, he reveres the Muso no Hitotachi more than anyone. My own respect for the Shogun pales in comparison to his. How could he ever even dream of acting against the Shogun? Three days. Come back here in three days, and I will show you the evidence. Mm. As a Guji, mm. there's one thing I know very well. People believe whatever they want to believe. Some things you do not see, simply because you do not wish to look. Mm. And so, it falls to me to place the truth before your eyes, in all its ugliness. Mm. <laughs> three days? <clears throat> I'll be here. But if I don't see any evidence, I will demand a formal apology for slandering the Kujo clan. She will have to come with me. Wonderful. Then I'll see you in three days. 
I look forward to it very much. Which means I have every incentive to find that evidence. That was so scary! Paimon wasn't expecting to run into Kujasara here. Well... Maybe. Wait, but actually... Liyai Miko did say she comes here every often, so the idea of you being surprised and scared and not expecting is kind of after the fact. But, Miko, you mentioned evidence of the Tenryo Commission's betrayal. Is that all in hand and good to go, or...? We gotta do something. Why are you always asking so many questions? Of course not. I just had to say something because I clearly wasn't convincing her. You wanted to make such a claim to throw her off. <clears throat> you didn't want to... S you spoke without evidence. <sighs> As plans go, changing the deity's mind is a huge gamble to begin with. We can't expect to be in control of every last detail when we're facing off against a god, can we? Okay, but what are we gonna do the- If we want to get our evidence, we're going to need some help. Now, come with me. We must awaken the professional. Okay. Alright, where is it? Find the helper who Yae Miku spoke of. Where are they? Ooh, you? Saiyu? Did Saiyu use it? That's how it's a new You just turned into a human! I'm too tired to get disappointed. One of these before. One of what? Mm, not a tanuki. I'm a Mujina. I'm so tired. If I don't get enough sleep, it'll stop my growth. Um, you gotta become is unwanted. This the professional you were talking about? She doesn't look very professional at all. I think you know what I'm talking about, Patrick. When I point right back at Paimon. She is a member of the Shiumatsuban, a genuine, bona fide ninja. Oh, I thought she was a frickin' Sonic wannabe. Wow, a ninja? So was that one of those legendary ninja transformation techniques? As much as I want to get after Paimon for making an almost Naruto quote, I'll just go with it. Uh, anyway, what's the Shiumatsuban? Matsuma. It belongs to the Yashiro Commission, a secret unit under Kamisato Ayato. She's a Sonic ninja. A ninja who's also a Sonic, and vice versa. <laughs> now, Kamisato Ayato and the Yashiro Commission are neutral parties, so I have no right to give orders to the Shimatsuban. Right. However, convincing their most chronically lazy member to help us is well within my abilities. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Here's what I need you to do. Go into town and find evidence of the Tenryo Commission's betrayal. It would not be appropriate for me to be seen there myself. You make it sound so simple, I have like... no idea. What exactly is the evidence? Hmm? Oh, I thought you would have figured it out by... For a complete outsider, probing the inner workings of the Tenryo Commission is nigh on impossible. But since the three commissions work together to serve the Shogun, they have a close relationship. Someone from one of the other commissions might have a... <laughs> now you're following me. The Shogun's army haven't given up on their search for you yet. But with the help of this Shiu Matsuban ninja, I'm sure you'll be able to rendezvous with your friends. Don't forget, we're on a tight schedule here. Be sure to bring back the evidence in good time. I'm pretty sure I can sneak on over there without being caught. Donkey. Donkey. Now. Tea house. Tola! Yeah. Tola! You there? Are you gonna pull off the doggy prank again? Talk to Toma. What brings you here? Here. Did, Did you meet with the resistance? resistance? How's the battle going? Is it safe for me to come out yet? Not just yet. We saw people patrolling on our way here. So, it's still not over. 
I guess, guess you came, came here because you have something to discuss? discuss? Yes, I want to know how to find out the right Shogun. I'll, I'll get, get someone to call for Miss Kamisato. Bear with me for one second. Hmm. You inform me and tell me the current situation. I see. Also, you have been through a lot oh, since we last met. You want me to put my headphones on? Alright, fine, I'll put my headphones on. A few moments later. I understand. You need evidence of the Tenryo Commission's betrayal. Let me think. Mm. Now that you mention it, there is one thing that has always concerned me. The Shogun's army has been at war with the Resistance for a long time now. <clears throat> but not once has the Shogun ever inquired about it. I used to think that she simply didn't care. But looking at it now... Perhaps the problem all along has been with the Tenryo Commission's reports to the Shogun. Uh, what do you mean? The Tenryo Commission presides over domestic military affairs. If they ever had any intention of concealing information in their reports, we would have no way of knowing. Now, the Shogun would incorrectly conclude that the Vision Hunt decree poses no threat and would stick to her decision. If we had access to their reports, it would confirm everything. So those reports are the evidence. But as I recall, the only person authorized to access that kind of official documentation is Kujo Takayuki. Right, the very person we're trying to prove uh, betrayal to. It's heavily guarded too. Even with Sayu's help, swiping a document from under their noses is no easy task. So I gotta swipe those documents behind their backs. If only there was a way we could distract the guards just for long enough. <laughs> hmm. A distraction, you say? We've done this before! Did we...? I can't remember. Maybe we did, I'm too damn tired. Uh, me as fireworks! <sighs> <sighs> Uh, oh god, the one who never shuts up! That's a very toma sounding suggestion. Really? There's a... there's a... Uh, a definite... There's a style for definition? I don't know. But it's a reasonable one. The statue of the omnipresent god is right by the Tenryo Commission. If someone set off fireworks near the statue, they certainly wouldn't ignore it. Oh, if someone threw a firecracker down the toilet, surely someone's gonna get pissed off! While they were preoccupied with that, Sayu could favorite? infiltrate the Tenryo Commission and take the report, as well as any other evidence she might find. And she's fallen asleep. I honestly don't blame her. Great! It feels like I'm getting closer and closer to being a free man again. Yeah, it feels like I'm closer to not falling asleep. <laughs> falling asleep. <laughs> It feels like it's been an eternity since we last sat down and talked like this. It's not been quite that long, but given how long it's taken for me to actually live stream, sure, why not? Well, it certainly felt like it to me. I've been looking forward to seeing you again every day since I got here. <coughs> okay. This tea house used to be my favorite hiding place, but now I've honestly <coughs> lost track of how long it's been since I last stepped foot outside of here. You you excited to speak to Yomiya again? Am I or I do wonder because she talked a lot in the previous time I saw her. Am I going to have to tell her to shut up again, or is she gonna actually shut up? Oh man, I want to go to the hot springs so badly. Then go to the hot springs. Uh, poor Toma. Yes. Let's focus on the issue at hand. The sooner the Vision Hunt Decree is abolished, the sooner Toma will be free. <sighs> this was a reunion of sorts, but there's no time to catch up. No. We'll celebrate properly when it's all over. No time to catch up. Oh, God. Ooh, let's play the hot pot game again. Uh, wait, what? You're still thinking about that? The Tenryo Commission is heavily guarded. Be careful when you get near. Okay. Let's... All right. First, let's go to Hanamizaka to find you. Oh god. So I could tell her to shut up. You? Yoimiya! We need an extra large firework. The super duper big kind! Incoming, a lot of talking in 3, 2, 1. Extra large firework? 
You sure came to the right person. That's not a lot of time. As it happens, I made this really souped up one just a couple days ago. But it's so powerful that I haven't found anywhere I can test it out yet. Huh, may as well give it to you. Let me know how it turns out. How awfully convenient. Don't forget. Move well away from it after you light the fuse. And uh, try to avoid burning your clothes. Also, it's best that you cover your ears. Why? You burn your clothes down? Which is why it looks like you have a red tattoo on your left arm. Which makes me wonder if you bled out after said explosion. Uh, uh, why does Paimon feel so nervous all of a sudden? Because we're dealing with explosives that can hurt if you're too dang close, and it's almost like we're talking about a nuke. <laughs> Don't worry, it's just a firework, come on! What's the worst that could happen? Mmm, I'm gonna let Patrick insert something there, if he has any idea. actually talk a lot. Good! Maybe the creators... Shut up. Maybe the creators learned their lesson and got her to shut up. Now! Uh, actually, I can't even go for Nuvolite or Kazuha because those are purple stuff wishes. I gotta be able to go for... Uh, blue stuff wish. All right, catching Mona Skyward Spine? Maybe. Maybe a weapon. Any one of them will do. I don't know. Times 10. Give me something good. Purple. 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 Bow. Sword. Cool steel. <gasps> no. <laughs> Soft. Noel. Don't need Noel. <clears throat> no other character, no other character. Choked on my own. Ugh. <coughs> Spit. Alright, fine. I'll deal with whatever I got. They all suck. 